Hey guys, Jeff here for BestTechie.com. Today we just got in straight from Bowers and Wilkins the PX wireless headphones, and I'm gonna do a little unboxing for you. So I actually met with the director of marketing at Bowers and Wilkins today, and uh, here in New York City, and he was explaining to me the you know the, the thought process and what what these headphones are about for this for the company um, and some interesting bit of news that they're actually planning on retiring the P7 headphones which come in wireless and wired uh, in favor of these I actually own the P7s myself and they're phenomenal but um, when I had a chance to demo these with with uh, with Jeff is also his name as it turns out. Um, you can really tell the difference because, and, and one of the major reasons why is because they use the P9 signature headphone, um, which they released not too long ago, which retail for about $800, $900. They use that driver in this headphone. Um, so they sound just so good. Um, but aside from that, they also use uh, Bluetooth apt Aptex um, HD. So that provides 24 bit resolution audio. And really what's exciting is, is well, really what's exciting is just unboxing them. So here we go. Uh, they already opened them up to, I guess, to, I don't know what for, but <laughs> they're already open. So let's just lift the top. As you can see, you know, typical box. Pretty cool. If you're into boxes, I guess. You lift off the wrapping paper. And here these are. They come in two colors, by the way. They come in this space gray color which is pretty nice, um, you know, similar to an iPhone, space gray, similar type gray color. And then they also come in this really nice looking gold color as well. Um, I have the space gray, that's what they gave me, so I'm gonna go with that. The ear cups are removable, which means, which is great, so you can actually replace them, um, you know, if you sell them or if they wear down and they get, you know, all gross and you need to replace them, you can do that with these. So that's nice. They do. They are replaceable. As you can see, they have the controls on the back. They went uh, for according to Jeff from Bowers and Wilkins, they told me that they wanted to go with um, with these actual tactile buttons because they felt it was a better overall user experience as opposed to having, you know, swiping gestures or, you know, touch, try and touch and figure out or even voice integration at some points. Um, you know, they just felt it was a better all experience to do it this way. It comes with a USB-C uh, cable and charger, as well as a cable, uh, 35 millimeter headphone cable. So if you go to the rest of the box, you just lift this up. Well, let's take this out. You lift this up. It comes with a nice carrying pouch, it looks like. I'm going to put these down for a second. Another thing that Jeff showed me uh, while I was meeting with him is that they have this thing called uh, uh, voice um, that basically it's it, it, so if someone if you're listening to music, right, and you're at the office and then someone comes up to you and they're like, or up to me and they're like, hey, Jeff, and you're like, just jamming away, listen to music in the zone. You can't really hear what they're saying at all. Right. Um, this actually there's a setting along with the uh, noise cancellation setting. And here are the cables, the 3.5 millimeter headphone cable. If you wanted to use it with a wire, it extends the battery life a bit, as well as the charging USB-C cable to USB-A uh, right there. Now, so basically I tested it with him and it's incredible. Like it's it's not, you know, it's not, they're not designed for you to put on and then, and then essentially listen, you know, be listening to music and then have a conversation with someone while listening to music. That's not the point. The point is really, to, so you so someone can get your attention, uh, you can turn this feature on uh, to allow voice pass through. Uh, that also has three different modes of of uh, noise cancellation: flight mode, uh, office mode, and a uh, plane mode. Um, there and, and essentially, there the way Bowers and Wilkins describes it to me is there there diff you'll get different sound and it's subjective uh, depending on what kind of sounds you like. Um, you know. They're, they they went out of their way to tell me that, you know, companies like Bose really have gone all out on noise uh, noise cancellation. They're not looking to create the best possible noise cancellation headphones. What they're looking to do is create the best possible s s sound headphones with noise cancellation functionality built into them. So really what they're really trying to do is, you know, just create the best possible headphone and not just 
uh, not just you know drown out the sound quality with noise cancellation as a feature. So again, audio is prime of, of prime importance to them, and they're really really nice, really comfortable. They they adjust really nicely. They have this great um, leather band top, super comfortable in the time that I use them at at, uh, at the office, and. Yeah, I, I think these are I think these are pretty great. Uh, having listened to them for just a little bit, you know, first impressions are wow. Um, they look great. They sound great in my first, you know, initial impressions. I'm gonna obviously have a complete write up review once I get to spend some more time with them. But yeah, so these are the Bowers and Wilkins PX wireless headphones. Uh, if you have any questions, comments, thoughts you want to share with me or uh, you want me to answer for you, I'm happy to do that. Leave a comment. If you like this video, feel free to hit the like button. And subscribe otherwise well just don't do anything then i guess close the close the page thanks for listening and uh remember remember take care of your computers